guys i hope you're doing well i have done this intro at least five times because i haven't done a video in so long Today's video is going to be for every person. If you are a person and you just became a Christian, this video is for you. Or if you, like me, have been a Christian for all of your life, this video is for you. And I'm just going to get straight into it. And this is going to be the big advice that I put in the title of this video. Don't matter who you are or what you believe, make it a priority to figure out what it is you believe and why. So all of us can get caught up in savings and career and job and family and relationships. But at the end of the day, all human beings have two things in common. We all live and we all die. The reason for that, I believe, is an objective truth. I, you, I'm going to use the analogy of a house. You know, belief systems, they're like a house that we build the more we seek and learn about it, right? Some of us only have a door open. We have a awareness about the faith. We have some knowledges. We know some of the stories. But how many of us actually make it a daily habit to seek God? And this, I'm saying this to y'all the same way I'm saying it to me because I'm not a perfect person at this. I have days where I don't read the Bible. I have days where I be laying in bed, I'm so tired, and then I see my Bible and I say, Lord, I need to renew my mind today. So I go and I read a little bit. Or I just say, you know what, God, I really can't take reading the Bible right now. Let me just sit here and pray with you. But I am saying that think about the fact that so many Christians in our generation don't even have a foundation in the faith. They don't even know the fundamental things. The first commandment is to love the Lord your God with all your heart and all your soul and all your mind. And there are so many of us who ain't even there on one of those categories. Don't talk about the rest of the Bible. We haven't even reached the first commandment. That, that like stirs up a fire in me, which is why I'm doing these videos. Because whether or not you do anything after this video, I at least want you to think about the fact. I at least want you to ask yourself this question. One, do I know what I believe? about the big questions in life, about life, about death, and everything in between, and everything beyond. And two, do I know why I believe it? If you're a Christian, do you know why Jesus claimed to be the Son of God? And that's just to deal with people who ask you about your faith. What about you? So much of your life could be addressed and handled and healed and, and helped if you actually knew what the Bible had to say about those things. If you knew what it had to say about peace, and not the sugar-coated piece of God's gonna drop in at night like a tooth fairy and put it in your heart and when you wake up, you're great. I'm talking about that piece beyond understanding. So, all that to say, my encouragement to Christians is to finish building your house. And when I say that, I don't mean to have a perfect, complete version, you know. Because don't matter what you believe in life, don't matter if you're a Christian or a Muslim or a Buddhist or a Hindu or agnostic or atheist, no one has all answers to every single question. No human being knows everything about everything. Like always, I feel like I can say so much more, but I'm gonna end the video here and I'm gonna see you guys in my next video. Bye.